It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Good. <laughs> it's uh, huge. About, it's huge. Exactly. So imagine coming here in 1370. Yeah. Never having seen anything. Like this. How big, how tall would your building have been in 1370? Not, yeah. yeah. True. This would have been. <laughs> you would have been in these tiny little spaces. The other thing that a lot of people tend to say to me is that they think that it looks quite dark inside. I think for us it looks dark, but for them it wouldn't have. And that is because only the bridge had glass. Oh, yeah. You wouldn't have had windows in your room. You would have had if you were lucky a stomach stretched out over your window. That makes sense. If you're unlucky, you just had your shutters and you blocked out all of the light at night. Or sorry, during the day. So it would have been super, super dark. Then I want you guys to tell me where your eyes go when you are looking. Well, right now the well, star, the star right now first the star. of all. To the cross. Or up high. The, yeah, the windows up there in the, the back. The point of Gothic. Yeah, all the time going to an optical illusion. Yeah, you go to the apex. So it's an optical illusion, which is very similar to what you said when we were in La Fontaine. Remember you said that the colors change as you went toward where the altar is and then above the altar. The same thing here, but it's done with the columns. So if you look at the columns, uh, you've got these big heavy columns down here. And the point of Gothic architecture was not to be big and heavy, it would be light and carry. So if you look at the big columns that we have on either side of us here, those literally are tons of stuff. Wow. But they're carved to look like tiny little columns yeah. going all of the way up. Okay, I see. And then as you go down, you've got all of these columns. You see how heavy the motifs are on these columns on the lower level? You look above, so we go from Corinthian, and then we have these nice, light, more medieval-looking columns up here. And although maybe that's not exactly what your eye looks at first, having that in the background lightens everything up and means that your eyes go up to the back windows. I see that. Way at the end of the church. 